So some people have said that PBFT, practical Byzantine fault tolerance, and ABFT, asynchronous Byzantine fault tolerance, are basically the same. Can you explain um, the differences? And um, I assume you're going to, to tell us what makes ABFT more secure than PBFT. <laughs> no, I'm not going to explain why one is more secure than the other. There are entirely different kinds of things. So if I say Alice is tall and I say Bob is old, Alice and Bob are particular people, but tall and old are things about them. So in the same way, PBFT and the Hashgraph consensus algorithms are consensus algorithms, but BFT or ABFT are things about them. And so they're entirely different kinds of things. ABFT and PBFT are entirely different things. The way you would phrase it is not which one is better. You would phrase, is PBFT, is it ABFT or is it not ABFT? And you would say about Hashgraph consensus, is Hashgraph BFT or is it ABFT or neither? Um, and so the way it works out is that PBFT is a particular algorithm. It's a very old algorithm. It is not ABFT. And that means that you cannot prove that it's going to come to consensus, which is BFT, un unless you make some assumptions about timing on the internet. So asynchronous BFT means that you don't have to make any assumptions about timing. Practically what it means is that if the attacker can interfere with timing on the internet, they can make PBFT be very, very slow. And uh, there have been papers that have been published about how that works. Because although it's BFT, it's not ABFT. So that was a lot of word salad. Let me say it again. Particular algorithms for consensus. Hashgraph, PBFT, let's take something else um, like proof of work. Those are, those are algorithms for consensus. If you ask, is it BFT? Is it Byzantine fault tolerant? Is it guaranteed to have finality? and that we will have the correct finality, everyone will agree, and that no one can shut it down unless you have a whole bunch of people agreeing. Is it BFT? Then we would say, proof of work is not. PBFT is. Hashgraph is. Yes. So for if you're asking, is it Byzantine fault tolerant? Proof of work is not. PBFT is. And Hashgraph is. Then if you go further and you say, well, is it asynchronous BFT? So we can handle DDoS attacks. We can handle the internet having bad firewalls doing malicious things. Is it resilient to those sorts of problems? Then the answer is proof of work is not ABFT. PBFT is not ABFT, but Hashgraph is ABFT. So that's how they compare. ABFT is a property of these things. BFT is a property of these things. But the things themselves, the algorithms themselves, are proof of work or PBFT or Hashgraph. Um, so I hope that made sense. Uh, it's hard to keep all these things straight. I think PBFT was a very unfortunate name compared to things like ABFT. But it was so long ago, it wasn't wrong at the time. It's just nowadays it's confusing because one of them is a property and one of them is an algorithm. And it just sounds like they're the same kind of thing, but they're different kinds of things. <laughs>